As the Russian invasion of Ukraine continues, there's a Ukrainian ballet company that continues to choose life on the road instead of going home. The group extended a tour that was only supposed to last a few weeks. It's now into months. Aaron Jones tonight showing you why their performance in Fort Worth was all about peace while their homeland is at war. They say the show must go on. And for the Kyiv City Ballet, it has. And I think it's just really wonderful that they're able to be here. Teresa Tran attending their performance at Bass Performance Hall to show her support. Back in February, these dancers boarded a plane for a scheduled tour in Paris. Then Russia invaded Ukraine, and they made the hard choice to stay on the road. And they're able to show us their art, even though their country is struggling right now, and I'm sure they miss their friends and their family. The art of movement and ballet and music and arts in general can help heal people and can help us all understand that we are all just people who want to live in peace. Tonight's performance reflects on war and is titled A Tribute to Peace. We would prefer that it be a performance for victory. I mean, yeah. the fact that it's been seven months, who would have guessed it would be that long? So, and it's probably going to be quite a bit longer. Yes. And I hope that they feel our support too by it being a packed house and having all of us here to support them. You know, they're not alone. And in addition to ticket sales tonight, donations were collected for a nonprofit that supports Ukraine. Tomorrow, the ballet will host a special performance for some Fort Worth ISD students before heading to their next stop. In Fort Worth, Aaron Jones, CBS 11 News.